Hello, my dudes. Rob from Open Source EV here, and this is a quick overview on the updated version of the left phone mount. Two big differences between this generation and the last one. First is really obvious. You have this updated design on top that has a stronger mount. It also has nubs on the front and the back, which are larger for keeping a phone mounted in the same location, especially a heavier one. The second one is following in line with our Evo mount and our seatback tablet holder and is compatibility with our new modular ball system. So the 17 millimeter mount is, uh, ball is installed on here. It has compatibility with the 17, the 20, and the 21 for a wide amount of compatibility with uh, many of the leading phone holders on the market. Uh, the installation is slightly different on this as well because that's been enhanced, especially with the new modular system. So let's go take a look. First step is to insert the upper portion. I find pushing on the A-pillar trim to be beneficial. Next is the plate. Insert the nut into the opening, rotate it about 45 degrees, move the upper portion out of the way, and insert it behind the trim in front of the vent. It will slide down, but that's okay. Next step is to prepare the bolt in the nut, slide the base up, latch the left of the upper trim and the left of the base together, and hold it all in place while you insert the nut and screw it down. It's important to not over tighten the bolt. You want it to be snug. If you screw it in too much, it'll crack the ball. Also, you want to ensure that you have it latched together on the left as well. Otherwise, it will move around. That click you just heard was the latch seating together properly. After that was done, and after it was screwed together properly, it is much more secure. That phone isn't going anywhere. Again, this is Rob from Open Source EV. Thank you for taking a look at this video, and I'll see you again in the next one.